All right, I am on my way to the store to go grocery shopping. I was supposed to film a tutorial for one of my clients, but I started watching Kitchen Nightmares. So I'll do that for you tomorrow. Emily, don't worry, you'll get it before your workout plan starts. Anyway, on my way to the store, gonna go grocery shopping so that we can get this meal prep done. So, in my journey to be a YouTube vlogger, I have discovered that I'm significantly less comfortable filming for YouTube than I am filming for Snapchat. Okay, we are here at Kroger. I have a list that I need to um, get my food off of. So on my list, I have natural peanut butter, big bag of almonds, eggs, even though we have a ton of eggs, um, but Ruben and I both eat a lot of eggs. So eggs are always on the list. Uh, bacon, cod, vanilla Greek yogurt, ground turkey breast, uh, cheese slices, avocado, Ezekiel bread, sweet potato, tilapia, and stevia. Those are all the things on the list. Um, so, let's go shopping. Oh, we have, let's see, sweet potato. Okay, ground turkey. Um, we have 85% lean, same thing, 85%. Uh, there's, let's see, this is not good. There we go, 93 lean, 93 lean, and 99. Um, can't decide because I like the flavor of 93 lean, but obviously 99 is probably better. It's more expensive, but only by 50 cents. I guess I'm gonna go with this one. I'm gonna get two of these. Wow, the 93.7. It's only three dollars and ninety-nine cents. Oh, so oh, never mind. This is honeysuckle. I gotta get the Kroger brand. 90 lean, 99 fat-free Kroger brand, four ninety-nine a pound. Good. There we go. I think that should do me for. I don't know. We'll see how long that lasts me. I didn't. I was irresponsible this time. I didn't do the. Normally I measure exactly how much I need, but I'm just gonna buy the two pounds and see um, what happens. And if I need to come back, I'll come back. If I don't, so I trying to film and shop is proving to be like really difficult and distracting. I'm kind of all over the store. Like I already left the produce section and didn't get avocado, but I do have avocado at home. I mean, and I could also just go back, but it's kind of weird for me. I'm like distracted. I'm not also because my list isn't grouped by um, like what part of the store it's at, which normally I do group my list like that. Um, anyway, I just picked up cheese. So, so that. now we're looking for bacon. Um, it doesn't have to be turkey bacon, so I'm just gonna get the cheapest one I find because that's what I like to do. Yes, $4.99 for lower sodium Kroger brand. Probably the cheapest I'm gonna find. Uh, turkey, mm, no, I don't want that. Yeah, I think I'm gonna get this lower sodium. 80 calories, seven grams of fat, zero sugar. Let's see what other macros we have on here. No carbs, five grams of protein, 80 calories. I'll take it. So now here we are at peanut butter. Peanut butter is a little bit tricky because there's so many different um, varieties of it and the nutrition facts. You had to check the nutrition labels to see, you know, what you're looking for. So I picked these three. Um, we have like store brand creamy. We have Skippy Natural with honey. And then we have Jif Natural. Um, so out of these, the Skippy has the highest calories. It's 200 calories. Um, the Kroger has the lowest calories at 180 and then the Jif has 190. Um, so now I'm looking here at protein where the Kroger one has seven grams. The Jif has seven grams. The Jiffy has only six. The Jiffy has nine grams of carbs. Or sorry, the Skippy 
Jiffy. <laughs> Skippy has nine grams of carbs. Jiff has eight grams and the store brand has eight grams as well. So, so far, honestly, this one's probably out for me. I'm done with Skippy, sorry. Um, but now we're here looking, let's look at fat. Store brand has 15 grams of fat. Jif has 16 grams of fat, so it has more fat. Um, so now here we have less calories, less fat, equal, what, equal carbs, equal protein. Um, this one, like I said, obviously more calories, more fat, equal protein, equal carbs. Um, but this one, let's see, we have two grams of sugar here and we have four grams of sugar. So you have to check where your carbs are coming from. So even though this one, they have the same amount of carbs, this one has less sugar. And also because it's the natural, you'll notice the sodium, this one has 80 milligrams of sodium. And this one, where's the sodium, has 150 milligrams of sodium. So almost twice as much sodium because it's not natural. It has all these other things. So choosy moms, although I'm not a choosy mom because I'm not a mom, but choosy moms choose Jeff. So we just moved. Um, so this is a new Kroger for me. I normally go to the same Kroger. I've been living in the same neighborhood of town for the last two years I've lived in Memphis. And this is like only my third time shopping at this one. And I don't know where anything is. So now I'm looking for frozen fish. I've already checked um, like the meat department to see how much the fresh cod was and the fresh tilapia, but I'm just checking the frozen because I can usually get more bang for my buck here, but I don't even know if they have it. So looks like they don't. So I'm going back to the other section to get my. Okay, so I actually found the frozen fish over by the meat area. So I'm gonna get myself this cod and this tilapia. I wish they had wild caught, but I guess that doesn't really exist. Okay, I don't know where anything is in this store and maybe I'm not even gonna find it here. I'm looking for Ezekiel bread um, and maybe I'm gonna have to go to a health food store. Although last time I went to Sprouts looking for something healthy and they didn't have it. So I don't really know. Stay tuned to see if I get Ezekiel bread from Kroger in Germantown, Tennessee. Okay, update, no Ezekiel bread here. Um, I asked someone, they don't have it. So, I'm gonna skip that. I'm also not getting the vanilla Greek yogurt because we actually have Greek yogurt at home. So, I'm just gonna eat that even though I actually hate plain yogurt, but I'm just gonna deal with it. I think when I have that meal, I get to put almonds and honey in it. So, I'll live with it. Not gonna get that. Not gonna get eggs because Ruben told me we have like four dozen in the fridge right now. So, not getting that also not getting avocado right now because we have a few at home so I'm gonna use those up um, now so the last thing I'm gonna need is a big bag of almonds so I might actually get them from the, the like loose section where you can just get them by the ounce or something I don't know um, but that's the last thing I need I think it's check out and go home I cannot find the nuts to save my life like oh is this them I popcorn, I should say nuts, so I know where the nuts are. Hmm. That's salted and roasted, I'm looking for, there we go, all natural. Um, that's more than I thought I was gonna spend, but I also wasn't really paying attention, so let them be So, learned. I definitely spent more money than I thought that I was gonna spend tonight, but, um, like I said, I guess because I was like in such a hurry to get this video done, I didn't really plan my shopping trip like I normally do. I normally look for coupons and look for sales and measure out, you know, I need this many servings of food this week and that's going to equal out this many ounces, which means I only need to buy one pack of this or I need to buy two packs of this. I didn't really do any of that. I just came shopping. Um, so we'll see, maybe $70 will get me like three weeks worth of food or something.